Hey guys, just another quick pickup video here. Um, I picked this up today. This is one of those, uh, I was told it was called a codex, but essentially it's a phono plug mail to F adapter. So what I can do is I can take my uh, Atari 2600 and plug it into that white end there, and then take this end and plug that into my TV. So yeah, now I can play my 2600. So that was, uh, it was like with taxes, it was nine dollars, something like that. Uh, I also picked up a few 2600 games. Uh, these were at a store, and they were two bucks a piece. Um, just give me a second. I'm just stacking them up here, so they're all over the place. I picked up Berserk. I picked up Jungle Hunt. I picked up Sword Quest Earthworld. Um, now, if you guys don't know the history of this game here, uh, they had three games. There was Sword Quest, like Air World, Water World, and Earth World, or well, maybe one was Fire World. I don't remember. But um, they had a contest with it, and the first one you'd win a like a, a, a goblet that was made out of gold with diamonds and stuff on it. The second one was a giant sword that was all made out of gold and diamonds. And the third one was a crown, but it turned out that only one guy won the goblet. The sword was never given out, and then the video game crash happened, and um, nobody got the crown. So, anyways, uh, I also picked up Phoenix. I picked up Pitfall. I picked up Space Jockey. And the last 2600 game I got was Battlezone. And um, yeah, I just think the artwork on this is absolutely awesome. It looks really cool. So those are the 2600 games that I got. Um, and I got a bunch of these games. I got uh, Saturn games. So I got uh, Daytona USA. Blackfire. Uh, Space Hulk Vengeance of the Blood Angels. This kind of sucks because there's no front cover for it. But uh, missed. Everything else is there. It's just missing the instruction booklet. Pebble Beach Golf Links. Last Gladiators uh, Gl Digital Pinball. Move the camera back. Off World 2 e Interceptor Extreme. Uh, Courier Crisis, and this one's actually still sealed. And the last game I got apparently is freaking horrible, but Corpse Killer, and this one is also sealed. It's kind of torn in a few spots, but it's still got the plastic still on it. So that's what I got. I picked up two, four, six, eight, nine Saturn games, and I picked up seven 2600 games, and then this doodad. So that's it. Thanks very much for watching, guys. Have a good one.